Hey guys, it's Say here with the car guys. Uh, just coming at you with another deck profile. I uh, went to the Kissimmee Regional this past weekend and I got fourth place, ended up going 7 1 1, uh, fourth after Swiss. I played uh, the True Draco uh, Demise deck. Uh, I just wanted to try it and it has Demise in it. I'm going to want to play that deck. I love Demise. I'm a fiend. Um, just got some quick shout outs. Uh, shout out to the car guys. You already know, best team in the world. Uh, shout out to people I came with my boy Kyle, Andrew Frederolo, YCS. Uh, 1943 winner, uh, Nikolai, um, and I got another shout out to my boy Gio, Gio Gonzalez, uh, he, he taught me a lot about the deck, uh, just uh, helped me make some correct plays, helped uh, make some correct deck choices and all that, so let's just get into the deck. Alright, so uh, two masterpieces, I, I, it's a bit different because everybody else is playing three, but like I, can, I just can't see myself drawing two of this card. And I already actually draw two of it a lot, which is weird. Um, yeah, I just like two. Two is a perfect number. I wouldn't change it. Um, best card in the deck. Um, three Dynamite. Uh, this card is just amazing. It sets up all your traps, and it allows you to tribute something to your first turn, which is it's just game. Um, Majesty and Ignis. Uh, I decided to go with one and one, uh, since I wasn't like doing two, three Masterpiece. Um, this guy's good going second, and this guy's uh, she's good going second as well. Uh, this, if you have a trap in this, because um, you against Zoo, you uh, you set a spell or set a trap tribute over this, and uh, if they try and pop this, uh, you chance effect the set heritage and just uh, free two cards to draw. So that's not bad. One of each. Uh, I probably probably move this to sideboard and just keep the six monsters. Maybe um, maybe test third masterpiece. I'm not sure. Yeah, this is probably going to the sideboard. And then seven monsters, spells, uh, three heritage. Uh, this card's amazing, especially in the mirror. You kill their stuff and, and you draw um, up to three cards. It's just really good. It's another demise. Uh, three pot of avarice, um, essentially pot of avarice, uh, disciples. Uh, it just shuffles all your resources back in the deck and you draw a card. And just these cards are still like quintessential at three. Because they each allow you to triple summon again on your turn, and it helps when you get multiple monsters in hand from Demise, so you need to lower your hand count. Uh, six field spells, uh, of course. Uh, and also to combo along with the field spells, uh, you put quick play spells. Um, these, there, there's a cool interaction with the field spell. Um, if you go activate the field spell, and they, your opponent does something to it, uh, you can chain any of, these field, any of these quick play spells, have its effect resolve, and then diagram pop the quick play spell. So like in, in in those common instances, you go activate, effect the pop, and then Dryden pop it. You chain the chalice, and it gets a Dryden, and then Diagram can pop this since it's still face up on the field. So you get like infinite value out of your chalice. Um, yeah, um, the quick way spells. Um, this could have been at three. I, I I didn't see. I I saw it when I needed to, but I could have. I would have liked to see it a little bit more. Uh, Cyclone. I could probably side the third. Um, this card's really really good. Uh, and Storm Forth. It's at one. Playing the one. And then draw spells, uh, three demise. You already, y'all already know that I love this card. And if this deck I can play it in in the format, you already know I'm playing it. Uh, two duality. I just didn't want to see multiple. Um, and then upstart. And it rounds up spells and traps. I played a little bit more than the norm. Uh, I just felt like it was, it was a lot better. Uh, the six true king traps allows you to trip someone in your opponent's turn. The all escalations. This allows you to combo like, by popping another spell or trap to pop another card in your opponent's board during their turn. So it's added removal. Um, skill Dream, I didn't really like it. Um, I didn't see it enough to where like I can say, oh, this card's very good. Um, so I, I just haven't seen it enough to give a full assumption on it. And Three Strike, uh, definitely my favorite card of the day. Uh, caught a lot of people off guard because people are usually just playing the six traps. So caught a lot of people off guard. That's a 40 card main deck and the side deck. Uh, one maxi, uh, two brutality DC, and two ghost ash. Uh, don't want to play too many hand traps because you want to. You don't want to see like too many because you have you play demise, so it doesn't make sense. But yeah, this is a perfect number. Saw them when I needed to. Uh, three board wipes against the mirror and zoo and dinosaur. Basically, against everything. Just going second, you just always put these cards in. Um, domain. I don't play an extra deck. Weird. We skipped it. Uh, yeah, Domain is searchable with three terraformings, and it's just an auto win against Zoo unless uh, they have spell trap removal. Put them on better habit. Um, two barrier. Um, this is just against Zoo. Um, nothing really special. The card's okay. I probably cut it. Didn't really perform well. Uh, two rivalry, so I didn't get kaiju every game. Uh, it, it was a good. It was a good call. And it's a continuous trap, just in case if you don't need it. 
uh, order against everything going first, and macro against everything go everything but zoom. So yeah, that's it. Um, yeah, that's it, guys. Uh, you're gonna see me at ARG Atlanta probably on the 18th. I'll be there for sure. Uh, yeah, that's about it, guys. Bling blah.